I think we're going to do the driving just in case we get those um, calls on the dispatch. I don't want to miss those. I think some of them are going to be pretty great. We're saying that we're going to have to come back to the black residence. Well, that's interesting. Make sure your family does its part. Look for the bin at your local grocers. Your help of some dry goods or preserves will help those who need it the most. Donate today, won't you? We're a cop. Sure that wasn't our fault. They shouldn't have been speeding. Available at your <laughs> favorite movie theater. three looks behind us. Cool. I don't know the city very well, so I'm taking a, taking a guess on this road. Turn on the siren when you get closer to it. Why? Oh, unbelievable. You're telling me. I thought they were going to keep going. Whoa, 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 whoa. I looked down at the map at the wrong time. <laughs> LA safe, drive safely. This is car eleven K. We'll handle the four fifteen. Is it on the other side here? Possible mental case. <laughs> Couldn't stay away from that one, could you? Here we go. What the fuck? You're the one who's been sending cosmic rays into my room. I'll show you. Holy yes, sir, shit! You're not gonna control my thoughts anymore. Just calm down, sir. This is Rockstar. You'd like that, wouldn't you? What the fuck? Yeah, you went that way. Thank you. Fast. Put your hands in the air. It's gonna get hit. Don't. Oh god. Can I not? It looks like we're gonna have to tackle him or something. I don't have my gun. Don't make me chase you. You don't understand. Someone has stopped Ow. the Venusian. Kicks me. Ow. Get up. Where's he gonna go now? Better not kick me again. There we go. Let him go, right? What the fuck? Well, that was a horrible, horrible mission. Ooh, was that successful or? <laughs> okay. I, it seems like we could have stopped him beforehand, but I didn't have my gun out. And normally when we are able to do that, you just hold down L2. Oof. The guy that invented the cigarette, I'd murder that son of a gun in the first degree. Now, it ain't cause that I don't smoke no 
myself. I don't reckon they hinder your health. I've smoked them all my life, and I ain't dead yet. But nicotine slaves are all the same at a petting party or a poker game. Everything's got to stop while they have that cigarette. Mm -hmm. Smoke, smoke, smoke that cigarette. Everything's got to stop while they have that cigarette. Play these old timey games. It's always so fun with the radio, especially with Rockstar. They, they always knock it out of the park. Their soundtracks. Whoa! What the fuck? Slow down. That was not an actual street. Yo, Tess, what's up? I've already we've already made it through the beat cop stuff. Um, we're detective now. Full fledged. Now we're trapping. Right now, I yeah. Gotta have a cigarette. They, and, you know, just being rock star and stuff, they obviously have some distasteful missions. Oh, we got another one. But we, I have missed, I missed something already. It's so good. It's such a great one. I, uh, I, you know, I have a bad memory. Oh, what's this? Oh, cool. Apparently we moved past it, but that was a special one. Landmark. Definitely want to check out the landmarks when we pass them. Um, I, to be honest, I actually forgot this was Rockstar. I remember playing it all back when, but I didn't, I didn't remember this was actually part of the, the franchise, you know. Or, or that uh, company, uh, they're, <laughs> they're amazing games, you know, but that explains it, and uh, I do remember the big twist, but I don't remember, I remember little things here, like, like this, this one, I remember that all of the blood in the, all the blood in the car is pig blood, so I remember, like, little things of that, I was like, oh yeah, I remember that was pig blood, but, um, Kid, drop that money one more time and you're a goner. Sorry, mister. It's just my hands are shaking. Shut up. Get the money in the bag. Yes. Yes, sir. Oh, right on, right on. Hurry the hell up, will you? Come on. Uh oh. It's goddamn cops. It's goddamn cops. Oh, shit. All right, go, 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 go. What? What are we waiting for? What the fuck? We got we this is our first time having a commandeer vehicle. We're about to lose the suspects. There we go. What are we supposed to do? Try to pit it? Oh shit. No shooting while in the car either, I don't believe. Nope. Oh fuck. Stop here! Oh fuck. Jesus, I can't even see anything. It's so dark. Oh, they went up. They went up. When one went up this way. Did he? Did he go or is he still there? <laughs> he shouldn't have uh, stuck his hand out, I guess. Car 11K to KGPL. 
Bristol Hotel 211 is code 4. Code four. Street crimes complete 40, 40 street crimes. That is so cool. That must be where it's at, because it's the main Enjoy missions. America's I bet you go through them pretty quick. With a frosty glass of Spencer's. All the way from Indianapolis, let's hear a song from The Ink Spots really windy right now and you know when it gets so windy some you know i have trees all around the house and stuff so it gets a little scary sometimes do we have another dispatch we'll do as many dispatches that we can get Oh, we killed someone. Looks like it doesn't matter for a cop. Yeah. Oh, it severely impacts your end of the case stuff. Wow. Okay, so we've already on our record, we've already accidentally killed a civilian. Great. By our bad driving. It's already on our record. They actually take note of that kind of stuff. I would have really liked to have gone through our whole career without killing anyone. But then again, when it comes to driving in this game, should have suspected it. Was far away. Oh hell yeah! Here we go. We gotta turn up here. Not the right turn. Not the right turn. Here we go over here. No, don't. I don't want to hurt anyone. Cinema? That's kind of cool. Let me just pass the cinema. She didn't die. She didn't die. She moved. Oh no. Come on up here and get us. What is all this? Traffic stop from hell. Crowley even pulls these guys over. Finds that trunk full of hardware like you wouldn't believe. They lose. Bullets start flying. And they snatch up the guns and one of the cops. Head to high ground and make their stand. And the officer? Up there. Still alive, we think. Who knows for how long. So keep him busy if you can find a way up, sir. Fuck. We gotta find a way up then, huh? Can we just get up? Run. Oh god. <laughs> we lost our hat already. Oh, I think we're getting shot, to be honest. Yeah, that's why it's getting all scary. Ha! <laughs> well, good to know. I thought being in cover was being in cover. It's not a pipe. All right, that doesn't count. Throw out the guns.
about over here? This pipe right here. Here we go. All right, there's going to be a guy up here. I, uh, I hope I don't have to gun him down. We're going to have to shoot him. I'm sorry. Shouldn't have been, been a criminal. How do we go up from here? Fuck. Oh, ladder. I'm not going to pick up the weapon. Why would I use a... Why would I use a... a, a Evidence. Oh my god. Alright, what about this guy? Got him. 11K. I've been involved in a shooting. It's code four here, but suspects are down, and I need an ambulance in Chateau and Valencia. Also notify detective headquarters. I'll need the coroner. My partner and I are okay. But I've been shot, and I need that ambulance ASAP. <laughs> I have about four or five bullets in my body right now. <laughs> Just hurry, please. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> All right. Let's see if we can get another call before we head to the next spot. We ha we're heading to the bar. I can't believe we're still on the same um, case. We're on the same case. We got a. Cause that was that was what three three different ones. They're really quick, and it's kind of sad because we don't get to have any understanding of of why like what were those guys going to use all those weapons for and stuff and it sucks but that's kind of the gig you don't you don't there's so many unanswered questions that's just life you don't get to get the answers explanations to everything but i just killed all those guys and i don't even know what they had planned All right, this is Rockstar. Give me a second. Okay. Uh, I'll take one of these. Uh, one of these hot dogs. No? Can't buy hot dogs in this? Tell me, I can't buy you hot dog. One said, "Did that taste funny to you?" All right, whatever. No lunch then. Guess we're going another day on the job. No lunch. We're on it. There's 40 of these side missions, and I want to do them all. Yeah, oh, well, definitely that, but I mean, like, for these side, these side missions, it's just you kind of, like, you just get the call on the radio and you show up and save the day, and there we go. Um, just really quick encounters, but yeah, I do understand, like, with the big ones, like, later on. I know that there's, like, a really big undergoing crime, like, I remember the, like, there's a main crime that follows, like, the whole game, and then there's a bunch of different cases. I remember little things, but yeah, this is, it's been a blast though already, uh, it, but it, it's kind of hard, the, the interrogation part, interrogating is a little bit tough at times. Try making it to the next intersection without killing anybody. I would try my best, we did accidentally kill one person though, and I feel bad, because it's on a permanent record now. <clears throat> I was hoping their uh, driveway would go all the way through like their neighbors did. They did not. <laughs> oh god, we're here. Finally, we started to take a gang fight. 
I don't know any of the the cop signs. Mexican kids with nothing better to do than how each other. But no bloodshed so far. Shit! Hope you brought plenty of ammunition, sir. Well, there it goes. Whoa, there goes my hat. What's that guy loading? Oh shit. Right, you want to get everything right. You don't want to miss anything. So that's the shitty thing, Tess, is that we're gonna we're gonna try to just accept our fate. And I did restart when we were playing the tutorial one because I didn't understand the controls and I, I made a mistake in the beginning. I didn't I didn't want to do what like I wanted. I didn't believe the lady. I just didn't know how to go about it. And there was just some mistakes. So we redid the tutorial one a few times. But now I understand how it goes. Good cop is okay. I believe you. Bad cop is, I don't believe you and you're hiding something. And accuse is, you're lying to me and I have proof. So come clean. <laughs> so as long as we play by those rules, we'll, uh, we'll hopefully be able to do pretty good. And we're, <laughs> I've already messed up one. So the first guy that you interviewed, the black, the black guy that uh, works at the train yard, he, he took a look in the wallet I let him get away with it. Oh, fuck. I was at my... I had one in my clip. I had one in my clip, guys. Oh, my God. We had him. He was dead to rights, but because we had to reload right there, we were dead. That's not good. Try again. Yeah, the facial expressions give it away. What I've learned in the first couple was that, like, they have, everyone has their straight face, their honest face, and anything other than that is a lie, is, like, is, is, is them fibbing in some way. The guy, when he, when I asked him about the wallet, he, he started making these funny faces, but to me, it was very much like, what a stupid question like what do you what do you even mean and so um to me i was just like you're right i shouldn't have accused you of that but he ew, i should have <laughs> so yeah <laughs> he tricked me i guess in that sense but i was okay with that one i don't think it's gonna it's not a make or break i think he checked to see if there's money in it who wouldn't find a wallet it's filled with bills Oh god, what's going on? Oh shit! Because I'm a bad shot. Hey, no, he's getting away. Okay, good. My my freaking part. He's dead. He just got killed right in front of us because we can't shoot. We're shit. My god, we're not good detectives. We're not good detectives. <laughs> oh my god, we just lost that man. This is so fun, though. Being a cop in this game, we play so many games where we're just reckless, just fucking criminals, murdering everything and everyone. Like, it's such a relief to be a good guy. How long do you think you can hold out? We got one more. Where is she? There he is. Shit. Yes, thank you, partner. Thank you. Oh my god, we have more. There's more coming. Master detectives. We got him. Oh, there's aim assist? Cool. <laughs> 11K, calling KGPL. I need an ambulance at 1624 West 3rd Street. Code 4. Shots fired and suspects are down. Roger on the ambulance, 11K. All units be advised. Code 4 on the major 415 West 3rd Street. Suspects are down. It said when we... Gosh, what was it? Something said that we were going to unlock, like, an outfit. And I don't know how to change outfits, but I really hope. Okay, we got to go to the bar. Then again... If we get another call in dispatch, we'll probably take it. 
Or should we? You know what? We've done a lot already. If there's 40, even if we do five in between each case, partner, why don't you take us there? Can you drive to this one? You're behind the wheel. Because I know if I hear a dispatch, I'm going to take it. Yes, awesome. I cannot wait to get some outfits. I know you. No, you don't. Oh my god, this man. I know this actor guy. We were at school together. Uh, how about you buy me a drink for, for old time's sake? Advice? Ask the barkeep. He'll know all the regulars. Watch this guy is going to end up knowing, knowing who we're talking about. You looking for someone? Usually the... Whenever there's, like, the crime dramas on TV and stuff, whenever there's the guest stars that are, like, uh, actors you recognize, Morgan they're always general. Sure <laughs> your regular. He's a loner in the back. They wouldn't be on the show if they weren't... They wouldn't have been paid to be on the show if they weren't, uh... Didn't have an important role, you know? <laughs> He's dull as dishwater, but I'm not with him for the conversation. Frank Morgan? Who's asking? This guy? Yeah, I'm asking, mister. Cole Phelps, LAPD. I understand you're a friend of Adrian Black. No way, I didn't, yeah, I, you know, I no. never watched Mad Men. Are you aware that he's missing? Well, that's funny. No, I hadn't heard that. Tough break. Ooh, this guy's an asshole. He totally knows. Friend and co-worker, and that's how he reacts? We found Black's car, abandoned in a freight depot, covered in blood. You know anything about that, Morgan? Hell no, uh, I'm, I'm sorry to hear that. I like Adrian, he, he's a good no, boss. Please, don't tell me you actually believe this jerk off, Phelps. I think you were in on it, Morgan. You drove down there and you let Black have it. Ooh, I'm a bad boy. That the best you got? Uh oh, see, I failed it, because we were supposed to accuse him. See, fuck, guys. We were supposed to accuse him with the evidence that we had. Oh, my God. The receipt for the live hog. See, this is why it's so frustrating with the game. It's so easy to just, like, fail and... Do you guys want to retry it? We just got here. You guys want to retry it? Test, should we restart? <laughs> like, I know what I want to question him. That was more so... Like, I didn't know that's... I'm going to retry this one. It's going to be hard to... No, we shouldn't retry it. We I know the connection, though. That's the frustrating thing. We just started. We're going to retry it. Oh, fuck. Did he just restart the whole thing? No, guys. Oh, no. That's not what I wanted to do. I just figured it would restart that part. I want to have a smoke. At least we'll be able to zoom through it because we know what we're doing. Here's your new desk, we'll just, kid. We'll You're speed run this one. The hot sheet is posted here next to the map. What's his problem? That's Biggs. He's an institution. So this is what all the fuss is about. Why couldn't they build a freeway that goes past my place? They haven't even approved the money yet, kid. The bond issue won't be till December. It'll be years before any of this will happen. Here's your new partner, Stefan Burkowski. I've heard all about you, Phelps. I have a problem. I want to play through this, which is like accepting things with how they are, but like, not if I. He's an intense one, isn't he, Mel? I feel like I made a mistake, right? When you when you feel like you make a mistake, you want to correct it. I already knew that there's a connection. I just didn't necessarily know that's what they were asking us in the moment. That's what we needed to talk about. I thought we were just starting conversation. Because he, he was all he said was that he he didn't like his boss, and it's like, oh, do I believe you, or that he said that he did like his boss? And I was like, I don't believe that you like him. Talk, you know, be honest. But no, and then said that's what happened. What is that supposed to mean? Stick with me, kid. You'll find out. Can't hear, but in this case is oh, nice. And now some housekeeping. 
Warm Central Division. Welcome for Detective Cole Phelps. Well, we're doing it again. We're doing it again. Phelps, he's the cop who broke the jewelry store murder. Stand Hopefully, because we restarted Phelps. this, we don't have to worry That's about. We don't have to worry about uh, the side missions that we've done, the calls. Phelps is one of only two serving LAPD officers who received the Silver Star during the war. You really gave it those lousy Japanese, eh, Phelps? Uh, I did my best, Captain. Why are you war heroes always so modest? I've partnered Phelps with everybody's favorite pole, Stefan Bukowski. <laughs> Hope you like work, kid. Bukowski sure is a little long cut scene. We have partners, right? <laughs> okay, okay, can it, guys? Stick with Bukowski. He's a good cop. He knows traffic inside now. I'm going to start you out with one case. You do okay? I'll give you a couple more. You screw up, you'll be rousing vagrants and running license plates. Now get down to the PE Freight Depot, Sixth and Alameda. Patrolman called in a suspicious vehicle. Signs of foul play. See what you can find out. Come on, Phelps. Second girl. All right, we're just gonna go straight to everything. Maybe even run through. They really pushed you through quick, didn't they? Six years on patrol before I got this desk. You were here in five minutes. What do you want me to say? I didn't ask for any favors. See the cop they've been talking about on the You know this place? Or another accommodation? Near the old gas works and signal depot in the warehouse district. I'll direct. Come on, Cole, leave him alone. So see our statistics to see if we've Street crimes, yeah. Holy shit, there's twenty six cases. That's a lot. That's a good amount. I think back in the day when I played this, I feel like it was just too, it just happened too quickly. But then again, with 26, that's that's plenty. That's not you know. <laughs> being greedy, you know. Oh, so they don't skip it if they have like important dialogue. So you won the Silver Star. I don't want to talk about it. Now let me get this straight. You single-handedly killed 40 Japs on this hill in Okinawa. I don't know how to search the house. No. You were up there all night, draped in the flag, knife between your teeth, gun at the ready, finished? The Emperor Hirohito himself leading the charge against you. I did my part, Bukowski. What did you do? I kept the streets of L.A. safe for the people. Yeah. Unfit for service. This party oh, line is better you, than Phelps. the radio. I earned a bravery citation during the Zuda riots. Dang. Sounds like you had it rough. I did my job. No one is saying you didn't. What do you want, Rochester? I did six years as a patrolman. Quiet, That's the third time you've told me. Uh, I found this letter from the doctor. Oh, yeah, yeah. Okay, let's get through this. I want to catch up. I'm kind of frustrated on this. That we got to uh, redo it all. That you, Bukowski? Go on through. Parking lot straight ahead. I need to get back to work, officer. The detectives are here now. You repeat to them what you told me. I did the right thing by calling we, this in. I don't. I'm just a yeah. working stick. Just give me like your story. Can, uh, and you'll be all right. Get our uh, fix our our our, <laughs> our failure earlier. You can call it failure. Or miss. This is your first case, Phelps. It's okay to admit it if you're stumped. You don't know what to do next. Just come talk to me, and we'll see. What we that can. one doesn't bug me as much because I that Thanks just legitimately fun. tricked me, you're right? Okay. The one that's at the bar that we restarted this with. Oh, hey, KG. What's up, guys? How's it going, fellas? Um, the one at the bar where we. I wanted to restart that conversation. I thought we were just going to start right back at the bar. I didn't know we were going to restart the whole, the whole, the whole thing. So we're going to just be kind of getting the details, getting our evidence, and then just moving along. Because I want to get back to the conversation at the bar. Hey, KG, what's up, man? The car is registered to an Adrian Black. Just north of Bunker Hill. It's one thing right. when you make we'll a mistake I'll keep Mr. Wilkie talking, but and like too they, long. the game tricks you, but it's time. another thing when you make a mistake and it's like, oh no, I I do have the correct answer for that. 
I just didn't know that was the question you were asking me. That's what bugs me. And then it's like, I want, I feel like I want to get another go. Uh, let's not talk to him yet. Yeah, let's... Doc, Detective Phelps, what have we got? A lot of blood for a blunt force mm. injury. Victim AG, wh where are you playing some more uh, Fallout today? How was today? Not unless he's in the trunk of the car. And KG, did you see all of the Stone Cold stunning that what happened over the weekend? Very safe. Mr. F. Morgan picked up a live pig yesterday. That's interesting. Why, uh, what, what, what made you do, uh, some Dark Souls? Oh, the I stone coating. So. Yeah, that was interesting. Dude, to be honest, I was certain that he wasn't gonna do anything more than just give Ke uh, Kevin Owens a stunner. Like, I was like, I was like, no way he's gonna actually have a match. He's, his, his knees, right? His knees. And you can tell, you can tell it's like, tougher but dude, as the match went on and it seems like as the adrenaline kept going he ended up like it seems like he kind of loosened up throughout but uh that was interesting that was interesting yeah tess i i know the the volume's down so if you still can't hear me i'm just repeating myself but uh i was in the middle of that conversation at the bar and i knew the answer I knew the connection, but I didn't know that's what they were asking me at the moment. I thought we were just going to starting with like a conversation starter and then we were going to move into the questioning. So it, I, I fucked up. I fucked up. I'll have to, I will have to focus and pay attention on the actual conversation. This is nothing. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I, I know when he gave the, that little, he does this kind of like run around with this biggest smile that he had when he got, when he got, uh, Pat McAvee. <laughs> the that was a really good one though. The, it was like a fucking elephant. Like it was fucking just the whole fountain of it. That one I put on the Discord. But yeah. The it was it was it was an entertaining it was an entertaining WrestleMania, I guess. One day off it's it's a busy day. Nice. That's I mean good for you. Everyone's gonna be or I guess yeah. What what you mean? Is your boss upset because it's a busy day? Thirty two years old, married. Sounds like an average guy. What was he doing out here? What was he doing out here? So guys, so we know yeah, there's all obviously this disconnect between those two. Happier times, I guess. The wife is honest in the conversation, or at least we think she is, but something's telling me there's more to this. There is this disconnect. Now, don't get me wrong. Growing up, one of my best friends, his parents, they slept in different bedrooms, but it's because it was because of a mattress situation. where, And it was also probably because of, uh, uh, like, I don't know, snoring or this or that, or, oh, or, or the timing of their jobs one work nights other didn't like it was just kind of awkward with this and that i don't know they had several ones but it's not like they didn't like they were very affectionate towards each other throughout the day and around the house when they're talking like so it was just it's just a situation that worked for him right so in this game with this these two had separate bedrooms he's tr I, but you know who knows maybe he has really uh smelly farts who knows maybe that's why Or we're gonna find out that she doesn't love him, and that she planned his murder. Glasses. We'll find out. Home repaired by the look of it. Oh, so tomorrow is busy, and today was not busy. But tomorrow, you got off work early today because it wasn't busy, and tomorrow is one of is your day off. So you also, so you, yeah, so you're kind of getting a day and a half, right? <laughs> but that's cool. I think I understand, which is cool because you don't have to work on a busy day. Or you're busy doing other stuff. <laughs> also, like, uh, people require different levels of personal service. I don't think it's weird to have separate bedrooms, you know? I don't think it is either. Um, there's... it. I don't... In my experience, I've always slept better 
when you're not sleeping with someone else because they always take your blankets and other shit. Um, or, you know, they're always hogging the space. Like, sometimes, at least just in my experience. Um, so, you know, I'm not I'm not 100% against the idea. Oh, with errands, then. I see. That kind of busy. Shoot. I call those adult days. Days you gotta be an adult and just get a bunch of shit done. Ask me why I like to check these things in order. I don't know. <laughs> Structure. I don't know. Looks to have lost a lot of blood. Someone took the effort to put A, B, and C, so I will respectfully check it in that order. <laughs> Saw the way he protected Ray Mysterio. Uh, all right. Oh, you're gonna say you're super impressed with Logan Paul. So you protected Ray during the running power slam, and that wasn't. Uh, oh. See, okay, so I don't, I don't like celebrities winning in matches over wrestlers. I liked how it was more so of just Miz kind of going over, <laughs> you know, of it all. He's because he, he he betrayed he betrays him. That's that was funny. Then again, can we talk about? Johnny Knoxville, because I still don't like the Paul brothers. I don't care, you know. One one thing, you know, whatever. I, I it doesn't fix everything for me <laughs> for years of this. Um, so I'm still not a fan. But he might be serious. He, he might be serious about wrestling. Uh, in a in a, you know, I don't know. I don't know. He, he respects. Me. I don't. I don't know. Whatever. Maybe. But that's cool. That's cool. But uh, Johnny Knoxville. That was so much more entertaining. I, I should have known it was going to be really entertaining, right? But that that was maybe my favorite celebrity match ever i don't know that shit was funny that shit was funny sammy's great that shit was funny uh yeah brand name might give us something to go on i think we've yeah we've checked it all now we do the investig or the inner interrogating. It's an interview. Just an interview. You don't have to be mean. Hello, sir. Sir, I'm Detective Phelps. Name's Nate Wilkie. You found the vehicle? Sure. Saw it just sitting there. Strange place to be parking your car. Figured I'd better take a look. And then I saw all the blood. So I called the police. Mind if I ask what you were doing out here? Well, I work for the railway. I was on my way out to the switch and reckon I'd take a short Dude, it's so crazy. Like, I was wondering... I was wondering... Was anybody else in the yard? Maybe somebody hanging what? around the car? Why did nope. Pat McAfee get so much so attention on him through all of this? Why did he get to have the match with Austin Theory? Why did he get to have a match against Vince fucking McMahon? Why... What is going... Like, what... Like... It was very just all I don't know. It's crazy. Like Pat McAfee is just like the luckiest freaking dude. It's just so crazy. That's that was very weird. I I've seen him in NXT and he was very he's always been very entertaining, right? Pat, but like, it's just crazy that everything that happened that involved him uh, over WrestleMania. That's just that just kind of unexpected for. Yeah. He gets a lot of attention. He gets a lot of... And he's funny. I, he's hilarious. He's ridiculous. It is just kind of like... What makes this guy so special? <laughs> like, in an outside perspective. Yeah. Yeah, okay. Well, that makes sense. That's why, right? Yeah. People do love him. He's hilarious. Yeah. And he does have that successful whatever thing now. But, yeah. You know, yeah, my nephew joined the police. And he's, he's a little slow, to too. Do you know... We're, because we're redoing Black, this... Mr. Wilkie? We're gonna no, catch him on his life. Name I'm familiar with. He's telling the truth because he's looking straight at us. You ever seen the car before? Funny enough, I did. A couple of nights ago, it was over there in the parking lot. I know most of the cars that park here regular, so it kind of stood out.
The wallet by the car. Was there anything in it when you arrived? You accusing me of something, mister? This is a lie. Yeah. This is when I'm supposed to be a bad cop, but look at that. He's just saying, like, man, what would I do with that wallet? Like, you're actually accusing me of this? Pfft. What a ridiculous statement. I said, you know, you're right. I shouldn't just jump to that conclusion. I'm going to give you the benefit of the doubt, and I shouldn't have. Let's be a bad cop now. Do you want the patrolman to hold you down while we turn out your pockets, Mr. Wilkie? Maybe I checked inside that wallet. Not that I was going to steal anything. Maybe I took a look. But there weren't no money in there. Not even change. We found a steel pipe with blood on it near the car. Do you know anything about it, Mr. Wilkie? No, sir. Yeah, but, I went um... straight for the law when I saw the car was full of blood. So on the topic of Pat... I think he's best behind the mic. I mean, maybe with, you know, obviously more training and stuff. But uh, it is interesting that... I was... I don't know. That was just... That was so weird. That was so weird. I wonder if they're going to go beyond that or if they're just going to keep him behind the mic and they just kind of wanted to give a moment. Just a crazy match. Crazy afternoon. So he's telling the truth here again. When you saw the blood, was it wet, bright red, or uh, darker like it is now? But you know how, like, I'd say. Pat's, like, very kind of goofy and people like him and stuff? Thank you for your help, Mr. People Wilkie. always we'll get tired of that eventually. Maybe, to, it, like, eventually people's silliness really that the made them so popular eventually just gets kind of... You're done here. We'll head over there like, if I'm being honest, when he, when Pat McAfee is being ridiculous and over the top, I, it's, I kind of get an eye roll. I'm not, it's not, I'm not really enjoying it as much. I do really think Pat McAfee is hilarious and he's very witty and he has some good stuff. But then there's just, like when he's be I guess it's when he's being over the top and you know that it's like he's being asked to do that because he did it a couple times on instinct and Vince liked it or someone liked it so now every time he has to behave in certain ways or some shit I guess when I see that stuff it's more of an eye roll but yeah I don't know where they're gonna go with this because it just seems like to me I just figure like eventually people would just kind of be over him <laughs> They get over everyone. Yeah. That was a funny... Uh, that's a funny one when he did the big big eyes and stuff. This isn't even necessarily the tutorial. We're gonna just gonna have a fast travel through these. Um, you can drive. Black's resident. Alright. Where to? We gotta search around the house. We've got to... Uh, what do we got to check? We got to check the bedroom. Phone in. One thing, yeah. Oh, God. Triple H just... That dude... It's so sad. I, I love wrestling, but I'm an emotional dude, and so... Let's go introduce I don't love. <laughs> I, I hate when wrestling has to be so fucking sad and has to be so real and just people um, that just have so much respect and they get their moments. I love to see it, but I hate seeing it because it makes me so sad. But yeah. Just a minute. Triple H is the man. He's the man. Um, just so much. Even when, tri when Triple H came out LAPD for. Champa we come in? for we the stand and deliver, I believe. We'd rather discuss this that's also, fire. that's I'm just kind of Black. nice. That was really kind of nice, too. Uh, we can discuss this in the living room. We haven't seen Triple H. Like, nobody's seen him uh, since the medical thingy or whatnot. And for him to, yeah, we saw a lot of him over the weekend. So that was cool. Your husband drives a blue Lincoln, Mrs. Black? That's correct. The car has been found abandoned, and I'm afraid there are signs of foul play. I knew something was wrong when he didn't come home. We believe your husband may be injured. We found a pipe on the scene with blood on it. Oh, no! My poor Adrian! Does the name Instaheat mean anything to you, ma'am? Yes, it does. We, we've just had a new water heater installed. Whereabouts, Mrs. Black? Just outside the kitchen window. 
at the side of the house. I'd like you to try and stay calm and remember everything that you can about last night. My partner and I are going to take a look around. When you're ready, we're going to have some more questions for you. Is that okay? Of course, officer. Anything to help secure my husband's safety. Well, let's check the place out. Come on. Have a good look around. There's got to be something in here to go on. Check our room first. I don't think there was anything in here. But I think it helps us to determine that they do have separate rooms. Someone couldn't wait to get out of this house. I have a free subscription to because of the cable company that I roll with, or the internet company. I have a free subscription to Peacock. Peacock! That's what I like to call it. It's on Peacock! <laughs> uh, <laughs> was, oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. So that's, that's, yeah. But I probably would still pay for it if I didn't, so... I don't have to worry about <laughs> that, but yeah, I probably still would have, so I guess that statement's kind of. Yeah. <laughs> Kavanaugh's. So who brought this home? Yeah, who brought this home? Maybe Adrian right. was a patron. Aren't I should have an address? We'll go to the phone. Yeah, newspapers are the best, Tess. I don't, I, we found two, oh, this is it, this is it. You guys want to watch it? I'm pretty sure that we've already, uh, let me call that in first. Let me call it in. Um, we've already seen this one because we're replaying, but just so, just in case the game restarted that, we're going to have to watch it again. Phelps, badge 1247. There's so much related, the, even the songs are cigarette related. Thanks for your help. Okay, here we go. I'm gonna smoke a little marijuana while we uh, watch this again. Yeah, these are, this is amazing. This is my favorite part so far, is these flashbacks. Lie down, make yourself comfortable. Or the telling of the backstory. So, you're a friend of Courtney's. Yes, Doc. He seems very concerned about you. I have these visions. These blinding visions. I can't get them out of my head. My skull, it, it feels like it's in a vice. I want to give you something to calm your nerves. to take you on a journey a journey back i want you to remember the good things about your past that's right. patience that made you laugh <laughs> thanks thanks kg thanks for the raid again man i always appreciate that i appreciate that thank you very much uh yeah have a good night man catch you next time <coughs> yeah if you caught the highlights, I wonder if you were able to catch, I mean, because you don't have to respond, but if you're still watching the lurking. Uh, there was so many Stone Cold Stunners. I wonder if the highlights caught them all. But there's like a scaling of the good, of what was good. I want to say that the last one with McAfee, it was a very good one because of it had the effect of the spray. But I still think that Austin Theories, with how high he got, I think he sold it the best. So I'm going to put his at the top, then I go McAfee. Um, obviously Vince is at the bottom because he 
Stone Cold really had a hold, to hold his hand through that moment. Um, and even then, he just took his typical collapsed stunner. Uh, I think Stone Cold or uh, Vince has taken a mediocre stunner once out of all of the times he's taken it. <laughs> maybe a couple times. Never did a good one, but I think maybe once or twice he did. It was like, you know, that's not that bad. Every other time it's been like, how do you not know when to take this? Oh, it's also funny that Vince, he blew his own, the own, like, okay, there was a couple spots. Vince being in chart, you know, he's the big man of it all, right? And for him to mess up, I always find that interesting because obviously he would rail anyone else for messing up. Well, um, not only did he miss, uh, mess up the stunner and, you know, fell and lost, lost his balance and then just, it was just all bad. Uh, he blew the surprise. He blew the surprise interruption because when, when Austin, when him and Austin Theory were standing there in the ring and Austin Theory's music hit, he acted like, oh no who's that who's gonna jump us like who like what oh my god can you believe that but then and then he realized that he said oh it's your music oh, okay and then they hit stone cold's music and then it was just like oh but uh, yeah to me it was like i feel like oh kind of blew that stone cold was gonna show up but yeah okay so now yeah i'm awake i'm awake i was having a conversation in my head you asshole uh all right so oh i didn't click i didn't pick this up last time Yo, we missed something in our first run anyways. This was only recently installed, not two days ago. Well, she did say it was brand new. Maybe she didn't lie about that. She didn't lie about that. Two 20 gallon tank. Hmm. $82. Guys, do any of you deal with water heaters? Uh, is this a good deal or is this crazy? Should we give them a call? Are they still in business? No. <laughs> they cannot rust or corrode. They are guaranteed for 10 years. Uh, 10 year guarantee. If you if the tank fails within five years, you will receive a new heater free. If the tank fails during the next five years, we will re we will furnish a new heater credit. Oh, crediting you with the unexpired portion of the guarantee. Okay, well, I mean, don't get, we're getting too specific. That's a steal. <laughs> this is an amazing glass line. I love that they put in the effort of, put, of someone making this brochure. I don't want to, let's, let's read it. Let's read it. This amazing glass lined gas water heater proudly carries an unsurpassed 10 year guarantee, a guarantee made possible by the proven advantages of the glass lining by an exclusive process glass and steel are fused together into a single unbreakable unit that cannot crack chip or craze craze there's no metal in the interior of the tank even if the water is chemically severe actions of the minerals or elements cannot affect the mirror smooth blue glass lining i don't understand anything i'm reading it stops rust or corrosion it's as safe and sanitary as a clean drinking glass so guard your family's health say goodbye to tank rust that discolors your laundry tank rust that stains bath laboratory and kitchen what it's designed to give more hot water 24 hours a day all of the day all of the hours of the day you're guaranteed hot water well more hot not guaranteed like fully steaming hot but it'll be hotter than it was before and that's a guarantee extra large inner fluid uh <laughs> never has any sense of heating service shared maximum low draft burner requires less so this is probably like very meter i imagine nowadays our water heaters i mean they're much bigger right i feel like some i bet it's the free engineering help is available if i promise something all right all right, well, that's a great read. <laughs> so, oh, so this is the beauty, guys. So I, we noticed all of this. Look at that. That's a lot of food that's just thrown away, right? Why, why, why is so much food thrown away? I questioned that our first time. You know, I saw the food and I said, hey, what is this? You know, why is there so much? Why is this, there's a lot of food here? One, I said, hey, maybe she's covering something up underneath the food. I know that's a pretty good idea. If you don't want someone rummaging through your like your trash, put a lot of disgusting stuff right on top. It's like, oh, you put something very criminal or something that you don't want someone us. to see in your trash. Don't leave it on top. Pour a bunch of shit all for it, you know? Get it just drenched, covered. Nobody wants to go through that. If these were 7000 so an $82 it sounds... Well, yeah, I guess so. 
seven thousand dollars that's so crazy I can't imagine getting a house for seven thousand dollars people would have so many houses they'd have to trade in all of their houses for a hotel and then there won't even be enough hotels for everyone because there's only so much space on the monopoly board wait what are we talking about no okay so um <laughs> we have to go outside we have to go outside so many houses so that was always a frustrating thing right you think you're just destroying it in monopoly and then and then it's like oh you know there's only so many so you can't you can't you can't have everything you want i'm pretty sure yeah all right so those flowers over there shook but they're not actually something not actually something but we're gonna look at them anyways Under Tess, you're awesome. See, you're so smart. So they won't even question. They can't even really question that you were eating their food. We paid you to watch our children, not to eat our food. No use leaving the thing half finished. You don't want to. You don't want to be accused of eating like the homeowner's like favorite food, right? So if it's under trash, clearly someone else did it. Someone before you were even there. Well, I didn't make this trash on top. How could I have? How could I have made the trash underneath? I just showed up here. You're smart. You're smart. All right, let's look at our IKEA instructions. Uh, yeah, maybe this goes right here. Okay, yeah. All right, this is our second time building this. It's, it's taken so long to get back to where we were. <laughs> and watch me mess up that conversation so the again. Pipe missing That's the kind of guy I am. Is the same one that killed him. Huh. Seems like the assailant is a little closer to home. All right. I'm pretty sure we've explored... I mean, do you think that there's extra stuff? I don't... We have to... Now we have to, like, question her. Oh, see, no music over here, so that means there's nothing over here. The fact that there's still music playing means there's something to get. Something to grab. Something to find. Heard a question. See, I was like, oh, man. Yeah, I guess that is. Yeah, sheesh. Oh, did we not go in here and check everything? I thought we did. We checked that. We didn't check this. This must be Adrian. We didn't check this. It shook when I got close to it. That's the same one on so the glasses are a match. Look at these strapping man. Separate bedrooms, separate pictures. What gives here? <laughs> Tess, because you're awesome. That's why. That's why. That's why. Only awesome people just go head first into those rabbit holes. <laughs> oh, yes. Okay, so we've already looked at these. All of these items are shaking, so instead of looking through all of her um, choices on decorations, we're just gonna go straight to this conversation. Excuse me. Excuse me. Excuse me. Excuse me. Excuse me. Oof, this is a tough one. All right, we're gonna go around because this isn't a weird thing for a detective to do. Circle, circle before they have the conversation. All right, ma'am. I like to have a conversation. <laughs> She's an honest lady, in the trunk for the most part. Car for Maybe. a live pig. This receipt was made out to an F. Morgan. A pig? Adrian runs a tool business. That would be Frank Morgan. God knows what he's up yes, to. Yes, that's that was weird, right, Tess? Why do they have pictures of themselves in their bedroom? 
Um, yeah, so she, this is her straight face. She looks down. She's sad. But we believe her. What makes you say that about Morgan, ma'am? He's the foreman at my husband's plant. A very shady character. I told Adrian he needs to keep his distance from the staff. If he drinks with this dude every night, her. how do they have the relationship that they have? He didn't even care about the man. Maybe they just attend the same bar. Maybe not actually drink together. <clears throat> Your husband frequents Kavanaugh's bar? How did you know that? How did you know that? Adrian practically lives there after work. I can understand that. My dad didn't frequent a bar, but so he definitely went to the same time. restaurant like Up until recently, every day. He's been away in Seattle. Maybe like this one or two days. No, maybe no, every day. I was gonna say maybe even like once or twice a week we didn't go, but it's not true. If it wasn't for lunch and dinner, it would be for one or the other. Uh, location of Adrian. Did your husband tell you where he was going last night? All he said was he was going to meet Frank for a drink. He was going to meet so him for a drink. The usual, then. Well, then they were friends. He came home early from work. He never comes home early. And he went out early, too. He normally never leaves for the bar till about seven. This was in a different order last time. Our alibi for her was the last thing that we asked. I think you should come clean with us, Mrs. Black. Your husband is missing, and after our search, I'm willing to call the circumstances suspicious. Can you account for your movements last night? You're not accusing me, are you? Oh, what an awful thing to say. I was here all night, of course, waiting for Adrian to come home. And she'll look a little bit down. Yep, she has to look down. As long as she looks down, a little bit sad. And she's just telling the truth. Is there anyone who can vouch for that? Well, no. I, I was here alone. I cooked Adrian's dinner and waited, but he never came home. Was your husband wearing his glasses when he left here yesterday? Yes, he just bought a new pair. Okay. Go on. I kept telling him to throw those old ones away. He tried to repair them with tape. It looked terrible. By replaying it, guys, you can get more experience. I don't want that to be a thing, but it looks like they, they kept the experience that we had gained up to this point. Get the same experience. Why is there music playing? There's still stuff to ex check out. Not because there's actual clue. Well, that that does have me a little bit interested. Cleaning their nice silverware. There's nothing else to find. Oh yeah, I know, but they said that once you found all of the all of the pieces of whatever, then the music stops. All of the evidence, the music stops. I feel like we should explore do you guys want to use? One of these intuition points, I think we can only store up to five. And we already got a few. Well, that's what they, that, that's what it said at the beginning, but I don't know how, like, it's true they stick to that, right? So I don't know if... I believe we come back here. Once we get more information from the bar.
Fuck it. See, this is this is like a way. It's like okay, if we mess something up with that, then that's just the dealio. That's just the way it goes. Who cares? We're gonna do our best, considering this was nothing though, irrelevant. The shed is locked. Nobody, I can't do anything with it. Maybe we come back here for the shed, and that shed back over there doesn't doesn't open. The music stops over here as if there's nothing to find over here. Right? So it's like, it's like okay. But then once you get closer, it picks up again. There's clues nearby. What about what's on the fridge? Nope. I, the stuff in here was... Is, 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 is nothing. I doubt it. What if we go... I'm going to go around and touch everything. This is going to be a science. This is science. We're doing this for science. It doesn't tell me anything. We're gonna go around and touch all of the items that my controller shakes to, even though I know they're nothing. And we're gonna see if the music stops after I do that. <laughs> oh, no, 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 there's something else. There's something else here, guys. This to my Adrian. To my Adrian. This thing gets more and more interesting. Are you back, my darling, Nicole? Um, excuse me. There we go. That's all. That's the that's the music it plays once you find all of it. What does that mean? Should we talk to her again? I'm all right. No. Yeah. Tell us about the photo of Adrian in the bedroom. What is there to tell? It's from his most recent business trip to Seattle. Oh no. Is this when we Wait. See, she's being honest again. But we know she's not being honest. That's that's her straight face. That's this is her straight face. She's not showing a toe. That's sad. I don't think she knows. Jacuzzi, but what would we accuse? Do we use the do we accuse her of said? All right. So because we have five intuition, I'm going to use one of them. Just because I don't want to mess this up, but we know something's up. So by finding out what they think, hold on, what do we do here? Ask community. What are you saying, Tess? No need. Oh, no need to? Shit, see? They know. But that's the thing, is now we know with this, so it's like... Is that what other people chose, or is that what the right answer is? Oh, they're more valuable later. So, all right. So, I did click it. Um, we're going to earn more, I believe, every time you level up. And it looks like you can only keep five. It's 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 like it fills up. So, I figured, okay, well, I'm going to earn another one in the next level up. Then we might as well use, right? Do accuse. All right. We're going to accuse. And we're going to show the back of the picture. Because it says XOXO by Nicole. And that's our evidence Prove that she's lying. Are you trying to find my husband? Here we go. All right, I'm with you, Tess. I'm, I would love that we do this together. You're lying about the photograph, Mrs. Black. You're incredibly rude and insensitive. But I guess you know that. I've told you what I know about the picture.
Sealed message. What about Nicole? The straight what? dope. <laughs> what? I'm going to leave you for her. <laughs> Tess, I love that you're helping with this because it, yes, we're doing I've it together. Seen the photo frame. It is so he, nasty outside, and I'm, I'm it stupid. makes me nervous. But women sense these things. Yikes. I don't know. Very windy. Very if he good. intended to leave me, or if it Thank was you. just a fling. Because I don't like making little don't mistakes. I want to see the entirety of the story, but I also don't want to just retry and do things. So we can get our first try. We'll keep you informed, yeah. Mrs. Black. Please do, Detective. Notice that how that she kept a straight face. She kept a straight face, so it's as if she didn't know. Oh yeah. Well, I, I, you'll hear me talking, right? You'll hear me talking, and, and I'll be, I'll kind of be like in a toss-up, throw your, throw it in the hat whenever. Um, that's fast travel. Can you drive to this one? That's good to know. Now this is crossed off. Before, when we were trying, it wasn't crossed off because we hadn't found everything. Oh my God, is that hail? Or it's just pouring. That's hail. Yeah, that's hail. Ah, it's hailing outside. Yeah, so that's that's an issue. She she would have tricked me. Jesus, if you weren't here to there. say Mr. And no, don't seem to show hail. Um, I don't know He's if it'll do it, but let's see. Too much of a shrinking violet um, to throw out. If this hadn't girl. happened, they could have stayed miserable. It's in the background, but yeah, see, it's just too bright. Did you see the flash? I think it, there was lightning. Yep, there's the thunder. Did you see the flash? There's lightning. But yeah. No, you don't. But yeah, it, unfortunately, it doesn't like show through with the... <laughs> I don't know if those are the squirrels freaking out above me, but something's happening on the roof. All the squirrels might be leaving that area because that's where they that's where they kind of hang. I always hear this. There's there's big trees around, so you, I always hear the, the squirrels skitter across the roof when they go from like one tree to the other. Hmm. Oh, I I wish I could get a like a good one. I wish I could get a good one. Yeah. It's like it's so windy. I'm going to I'm going to do a I'm going to do a Instagram thingy. It's so windy that the hail, well it's it's slowing down now, but I can see the hail is like moving as if it's snow. But it's not snow. <laughs> Looks like it's calming down now. So we might have missed it. If it picks up again. If it picks up again. Yeah, now now everything's just dropping, so the wind stopped. Everything's going straight down. That was very weird. Yeah, I'm looking for someone. Ooh. Oh, why are we still in this? We're playing the game. Didn't realize the game. My bad. <laughs> yeah. A turkey salad sandwich. Frank Morgan? Who's asking? Motherfucking Cole Phelps. Cole Phelps, LAPD. I understand you're a friend of Adrian Black. Yeah, I know him. Are you aware that he's missing? No, I hadn't heard that. Tough break. Okay, link to abandoned vehicle. We have the link because we have the receipt that has his name, F. Morgan, on it for a live egg. 
We found Black's car, abandoned in a freight depot, covered in blood. You know anything about that, Morgan? Hell no. Uh, I'm, I'm sorry to hear that. I like Adrian. He, he's a good oh, boss. Please, don't tell me you actually believe this jerk-off, Phelps. Jacuz. You're lying, Morgan. You were there. And you're talking out your ass, detective. How about you prove I was out at that rail yard? How about a receipt with your name on it? Does that prove anything to you, pal? You were there, Morgan. We found a receipt in the trunk of the car. It has your name on it. We can call the slaughter yard and nail you on it. All right, already. That fool Adrian's falling for some dame in Seattle. He wanted cool. me to make it look like he'd been attacked. Oh my god, is that really what's happening now? That's so sad. Where exactly is Black Hold Up? That makes so no much idea. more sense because they are friends. I think he took off for Seattle. He's lying. He's still here. Bad cop. Bad cop. Because we can't prove anything with this, so we just have to go with bad cop because we don't believe him. I'm tired of your shtick, Morgan. Sorry. Spill it! Or we take you out in the alley and we knock it out of you. He's holed up at my place. He's waiting for some money to come through before he blows town. An address? It's an apartment house at the corner of Temple and Figueroa. Apartment number two. They use the pig's blood to stage the that's all. murder or Thanks whatnot. Help, Morgan. Motherfuckers. Hey, this wasn't even a real case. It was a trick. I love cops. Cuff him, let him go. It's up to you. Yay. No way I'm we got the Sunstretch Shrimp outfit. Something to arrest. Oh yeah, 100% we're arresting him. 100% I'm arresting him. There, he's 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 complying in uh, in this fucking. Morgan's address. Let's get over to his. They're wasting our valuable time. Do they think that this was gonna be okay? Absolutely arresting him. It's the best one. I bet they're all awesome, Tess, but I believe you. <laughs> we got a sleepy dude here. We got a sleepy dude here. He's always, he, like, this is, this is my controller hand and my arm, and he always lays on top of it, so. It's like, I can barely play. Uh, he's so sleepy. Then we got Kane down here. Kane. Dude, does the camera, it doesn't show right where he is. That's funny. Where's Kane? Where's Kane? Where's how's that not spot Kane? Oh, it's right there. Yeah, that was a lot harder than I thought it was. I shouldn't have done that much. Hey yo. Oh no, it's actually right back to work. Well, that was actually a perfect bend back. Fantastic. All right, let's get back to it. Gang, 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 gang. Apartment rented by Frank Morgan. That's where we're headed. This guy's going to jail for wasting our time. Right? You'd arrest these people. Hey, Mr. Melty Man. These guys should go to jail, right? They shouldn't just be let go for, for what they do. They're wasting our time. They're trying to fool us. What? Oh, the pig blood. Roger, KGPL. Time to reel this guy in, Phelps. New clue. Swine blood. Alright, we'll do this real quick before we get the guy. But from here, we're going to go straight to him. The driving in this is very sensitive. Notice how I go back and forth a lot. It's it's just it's it's very sensitive. See how quickly you can just yeah. Uh, uh, <laughs> That's okay. So I'm afraid we're probably gonna get in some accidents. I'm afraid. I we already accidentally ran over a pedestrian. I was just sitting on a bench. She didn't make it, and we've already got that blemish on our record. I just hope that doesn't 
doesn't hurt us too bad. But the, the the game did say that they that will severely impact your your stuff, your score of how how good of a cop you are. This is far. What the hell is this? <laughs> yeah, I know. We should have our siren on, but we don't want to play the game with sirens on the whole time. Let's just pretend it's going. Well, let's do it for a second. We're responding to a call, right? So, shit. Now look what you've done. All units of 459 just occurred at 6th and Saras. Any unit to handle, code 2 identified. 11K, go ahead, KGPO. 11K, a 459 suspect just... Yo, we already did this one. Up on the roof, officer. He has a mask on his face. I caught sight when he shoved past We're going to have to redo careful. all of those now. Gun. That means the next four ones we do, we've already done, but because I restarted, it's go they're gonna count it as we didn't do them. That sucks. That's okay, they're really short. They're not that bad. And now we, we kind of know how to go about all of them. Give it up now. Make it easy on yourself. Get the hell away from me. this way thanks yeah is somebody gonna tell us what the hell is going on I don't want to shoot the man guess we could have Because this, we don't want to shoot him now because of, I guess we could have protected it because of this part. I knew that we were going to get to this. It's only, he was firing at me. How long do you think you can hold out? Let's, let's not make, let's not fail this time. You want to back off, right? We're going to wait for him to do that again on this side. I'll do it. I swear to God I will. Oh, yeah, yeah, I missed again on that first shot, but it's good if you just kind of unload real quick, because then if he moves his head, he's probably going to get hit by at least one bullet. <laughs> well, in this case, to be honest, I kind of want to drive around until we get those other dispatch ones done again. Then I'll actually feel like I caught up. Damn it, I tried to do it again. I really tried to do it again. Damn it. That would have been funny. That's my new goal. I'm going to try to be in, uh, one of those guys to my partner. Constantly. Constantly. <laughs> hmm. <laughs> hmm. <laughs> Pop is saying get a different result. You know, that's a really good... That's good question there Melty I don't know and it would take too long to try to redo that so I don't even know if I can I know I can redo the main stories I don't know if I can redo those ones yeah. maybe maybe instead he just gets arrested what if uh, I could have gunned him down in the street I had a shot maybe we gunned him down before he even got to the game I guess that could have been a different result in a way but he still would have been not too much of a different Oh, landmark. Cool. Parishing Square. Very cool. Ah, that's mean. But yeah, you're right. It would have been hard. I would have for sure shot the dude. And with how this game, like, it, they don't make it really quick to retry real fast. So, yeah, that, <laughs> I don't know. That would have been rough. Oh. The mental case one. See, this is this is, it's Rockstar, guys. It's Rockstar.
But it looks like this is actually... I, I remember this game being shorter than I think it is. So I'm pretty excited for that. We should be playing this all week. And I thought maybe we'd get it done within a couple days. No. There's like 40 of these side missions. We're going to be doing number two in a second. And then there's like 26 main missions that are actually pretty long. So... This is Kari, I'm, ha I'm, I'm fine with it. 415. You're the one who's been sending cosmic rays into my room. I'll show you. Yes, sir. You're not going to control my thoughts anymore. Just calm down, sir. Hey, hey Tess, what does ACAB, like what's ACAB mean? Are we going to learn something? What's me? Give it up, LAPD. <laughs> there we go. Yep. <laughs> can we save him? Oh my God, we can't save him. Please, please, I don't want to. I don't want him to die. Don't make me chase you. No. No, we can save him. You can have different outcomes. No, 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 stop running. Farewell, cruel world. That sucks. There was that small moment where I feel like maybe we could have cut a corner enough to maybe get him. But we could have saved him. But did, did you guys see it only popped up for that small second and we weren't close enough. I was tap and tackle, but we weren't actually close enough yet. That sucks. So what was the third one? The third one... Well... Oh, there's a... Car that got stopped for traffic infraction or whatever. And they had... It was filled with guns. Why the officer wanted to check the trunk? I swear to God, this better not bring me all the way back to this better not restart the entire mission. It better bring us to right after we just, just that one that just happened. This does have an autosave, right? Oh my God. I hope that doesn't bring us back too far. I've already spent like an hour or so or more replaying what we've already, what I had already played earlier. Crashed. Just a crash. Random crash. <laughs> how did how it happens? Yes, please. Wait, can I not buy one of these? What do you think? You got Morgan's address? Let's get over to his apartment. I guess we'll know how much it's saved uh, based on the next uh, the next um, dispatch we get. hear the extra effects they put on those like bad calls how it's 
It, it kind of sounded like a theremin, but, it, you know, it's, it's the, uh, oh god. It was, uh, like, distortion and stuff. I think that's awesome. finish. Maybe because I was holding down. Maybe I have to hold down circle or I don't want to hold down R2. One or the other made it skip. But we're good because this isn't, this isn't, uh, I, I think we're good. I think we're good. It crashed right after we finished that other dispatch. I really wish we could have saved, tackled the, oh god. Guy with a disorder. Good one. Eleven K responding. Go ahead, KGPL. Yo, this is different. They do mix it up. They gave us the first two, the same. It was the same order as as like before. So I was thinking they were giving us. All of them in the same order, but no, this is different. Maybe because we had to restart. Oh, we got a runner. Oh, speed. So Benny's giving him speed. <laughs> Get the hell down from there, you lunatic! Yeah, so I was kind of under the impression that, yeah, that they were going to do whatever. We're them all the same. Are we going? Oh, God, where did I go? We're going up? Oh, it's the ladder right here. I didn't see it. He's going to get away. I didn't see him actually go up it. All right, there he is. We see him. What is he doing? Oh, shit. Wait, how do we do this? I could have sworn it was... What? How is this? I don't know. Oh, it's L2. L2. That's how it starts us. There we go. Let's do this. Do it again. We stay down, buddy. <laughs> do it again. <laughs> That's what he was gonna say. He was gonna say, "Do it again." Yes. The, uh, That's why um, I gave that one guy space. The mental case one. Uh, the mission. That that's what it was called, or whatever. Um, I gave him space for a second because I remember last time I tried to chase him and and I was right on his ass and kicked me and it made me fall down and I didn't catch up to him so I was hoping if I gave him just a little bit of space I'd be able to get to the roof and make the distance. Okay, well if they're just gonna give us random ones, let's go straight to the let's go straight to the next part of this Can mission. You drive to this one? I was gonna just try to catch up to where we were before I had to restart. Yeah. All right. So this guy's going to jail. He's wasting our time. He tried to lie and claim, try to get out of his marriage by faking his death. Ridiculous. Well, let's check the place out. Come on. Best deals, discountest prices. Discountest? Love it. Air conditioned. I'm into it. It is hot out here. <laughs> so we're looking for F Morgan. Apartment two. That was quick. Maybe we go visit. Who's that five or six? Whatever. We'll go to F Morgan. I think this guy's gonna run. He's kind of a heavy guy. I don't think he's gonna run. He's gonna have a gun. I don't think he's going to have a gun. Think he's going to cry? He might cry. There we go. Are you ready? Oh, shit. I was talking to my partner. I was ready to bust down this door. Help you, gentlemen? LAPD detectives, Mr. Black. You're under arrest. Mm-hmm. Look, I'm really sorry about this. I never tried to hurt anyone. I just needed to get away from L.A. 
I won't put up a struggle. Just let me get my. He's gonna run. He's gonna run. He's gonna run. Phelps, go after him. I'll try and hit him off in the car. Remember, gonna run. Motherfucker. Don't arrest you, Kenny. You know. <laughs> yeah. No yeah. Running, Shit, where'd he go? Oh god, he went down. How did he go down? Ah. There we go. Ooh, nice roll. He's over here. This is a big guy can Mr. run. Black, get back here right now. Stop right there, Adrian. It's over, Adrian. Oh, I was gonna tackle him. Come on. Why the melodrama? I was gonna tackle him so hard. Isn't that what cops do? Adrian Black, you're under arrest for conspiracy and fraud. We'll see what the DA has to say about wasting police resources on a wild goose chase like this. You're gonna lose your wife, lose your job, and probably end up in the big house. <laughs> Stop, really? I really hope she was worth it, Adrian. Yeah. I hope Nicole was worth it. By the way, Dina, why don't you tell us a little bit about her? That turned out to be quite some case, huh? Adrian, what an idiot. You got an arrest and a clearance in your first case, and in fine style, too. Well done, Oh, it tests as hell. Efficient investigation technique. Good I would have messed presence. up on that one. You keep that <clears> up and you learn from Bukowski here. You can go a long way in this department. The third degree. We did 100%. Vehicle damage? <laughs> Prove it. City damage? Where's the where where's the video footage, huh? Injury is zero. That means that the murder, you know how I said earlier I accidentally ran over the lady that was on the bench? That didn't happen. Wipe clean. Because we had to restart. Wipe clean. Adrian Black can now look forward to his day in court and a beating from the LA press. Hmm. Hmm. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. See, this is fun. I love how they do this. It's so good. We sh we have the option to play this game in black and white, and it's it's tempting. <laughs> yeah. But because they gave us a little bit of black and white, I do kind of like how it fades okay, into we're gonna color. Keep this so short. Cool. I'm already late for the DA. First up, Phelps Bukowski. We got a report of a brand new Packard abandoned in an empty lot off Second Street between Olive and Grand. DR is one Oswald Jacobs says the vehicle was dumped in his backyard. There's a patrolman on site. Get down there and see what you can turn up. Any questions? Good. Get going. So traffic it basically just means abandoned vehicles. Is that my de is that our pathetic wages? Is that what we do here? Check out abandoned vehicles. Jesus. I thought we were going to go give people tickets. An abandoned vehicle. Hey, why don't you save some uh, some of that for the rest of us, huh, pal? There's more to it than that. Nobody dumps a shiny new Packard unless they borrow. Hey, how about you uh, make some space for the rest of us, huh, pal? You're on fire today, Einstein. People. Very funny. Come on, my intense protege. Let's go save the world. Going to church doesn't make yeah, I guess that would make sense. Tickets are for beat cops. I wish that we were a beat cop for a little longer. It was just for the tutorial missions. Granted, there was a few things that happened, but I did like being the beat cop. Do we? No, that's a beat cop mobile. We're detectives now. We drive the detective mobile. Cinematic camera? Love it. Oh, that changes the map? I didn't figure out what things did. Okay, here we go. You hear about Adrian? The broad in Seattle threw him out. The wife says she's gonna take him back. The broad in Seattle threw him out? What are you talking about? Adrian dumped on her and he was humping the secretary. Margaret should show some pride. Pride comes before a fall, Bukowski. Talking from experience. Ooh. That's interesting. Oh, and now it's all nice and sunny here, guys. Next five minutes, you're funny. Uh guys, the camp the um oh gosh. Alright, I'll give you some cinematic cam later. Right after.
for the whole mission would be cinematic game. Um, outside, you know, it was hailing wind, whirlwind hail. It's it's a nice sunny spring day. I'm off to A little wet, I guess. But... Crazy how the weather goes. We got a call about an abandoned vehicle. Jacob. Yes, sir. The car has flags. Might be some kind of diplomatic vehicle. Has anyone touched this vehicle since you arrived? No. And that Jacob's bird over there was on station before I got here. We'll talk with him in a moment. Give us some time to look the place over. Yeah, that's sure, funny. Mountie, it, it, for whatever reason, it started anyway. pouring, and then it was it, it started to hail, and then there was one flash of lightning and some thunder, and then now it's sunny. <laughs> that was that was the that all happened in a span of like a few minutes. I feel like we should question Jacob's bird, or Jacob over there, but maybe we should look at a uh, invest. We should look at our. Uh, Directories. It's owned by the Argentinian Embassy. Argentinian Embassy. What well, doesn't that make things a little bit? What the hell, really? I mean, how many times have they checked abandoned cars and there was nothing going on? Then again, I guess there's probably a case before anything. Always check the trunk. Empty. Empty. Empty trunk. Okay. License plates are missing. Oh, oh you hear him? That's funny. That was dude. Ah, oh, I missed a car? Or a tire? Stealing the wheels is for amateurs. The car ring would have stripped it in a warehouse. I don't even wish to leave it. Oh, I see that it's from the embassy. Look, the flag is right there. It's funny. Hey! Get out of the shot! You wanna say that's my freaking face, pal? Huh? How about you leave some pictures for the rest of us, huh? Yeah. Oh, there's no flag on the other side. You must have taken the flag as a souvenir. Can't have it any street value. What do we got here? Why was he looking at that? Not everything here is going to be relevant. Yeah, no shit. Something over here, though, that's shining. Oh, trash and trash. This is there. What does that say? Of oh, the Dewey Bros. Must have used it to remove the wheel lugs. Okay, here we go. We're getting something here. So that's all of the... Oh, uh, this is a little baseball field. Love it. That's all of the... Police box? That's all the, um, 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 the word I'm looking for is evidence. See what this Jacobs guy has to say. Yeah, I do, but I also want to... I want to use the police box. Be a TARDIS in there. You never know. All right, where is he? Jacob is over here. What, are you gonna pump me up for it? There we go. Oswald Jacobs. That's right. A lot of actors what in this exactly that I recognize. Here, Mr. Jacobs? They really Last went all night, out. I <laughs> well, I mean, they were all window. like little actors. I like to but keep so. an eye on what's going on. I can understand that. You see this empty lot? It's just so Damn cool they got recognizable faces. All here, always breaking my windows. Always asking for their ball back. Can we get back to the car, Mr. Jacobs? Don't be impatient, Sonny. Anyway, last night I see this brand spanking new Packard up on bricks. Or 
Argentinian consul, license plate. But so the car was stolen and they uh, brought it over there to take it apart. Why would they only get one wheel? Did you see who stole the package? Hell yes, I did. I saw three goddamn Mexicans going to work on it. <laughs> okay. First off. If it was the Dewey Bros, there's no Mexicans named Dewey. But. All right, we have intuition at five again. I'm going to use an intuition. Oh, they think it's a good cop. You think that that was an honest answer? It was just a bunch of Mexicans doing it. Who, the, who, what you tell me what kind of Mexicans are named Dewey? <laughs> Can you tell us what they were doing? Using the headlights of an old Ford so they could strip the thing. I yelled out to them, I'll call the cops. So they loaded up their car and drove off, tooting and hollering and yelling obscenities at me in Mexican. You speak Spanish, sir? No, I do not. Say what? Yeah, it was. Hispanic suspects. Maybe we can question more so into it being the Dewey brothers with this. After the uh, Mexicans left. <laughs> After the, the Mexicans left. I like how he did that. No, I didn't go anywhere that near funny. that car. Is he lying? He's lying. He's lying. Bad cop? We don't have any proof, right? So we're, we're just going to accuse him. <laughs> you went out to the car. Once they were gone, you had to take a look for yourself. I, I didn't do curious. nothing. He, he was giving us his best Robert De Niro there. So what if I took a look around? You can trust car? me. You can trust me. Accusing me of nothing. Uh, possible suspect vehicle. Tell me about the car they were driving. It was an old Ford. I didn't catch the license number. <laughs> old Ford. This is honest. You look like the kind of guy who notices details. You're right there. The car was old, but it looked brand new. Candy apple red paint job stands out a mile. <laughs> what exactly did you see them take? They was working on the tires. That's all that was took. That's not true. Uh, we can accuse and then... Oh, he took it. I think he took it. We're going to talk about the missing. See, we have a we have a missing license plates. We have missing Argentinian flag. I want to bring up the flag. Well, no, cuz they said that all he took they he just said that all they took was the wheel, right? Why did you take the license plate? Me? Well, what would I do with license plates? You saying I have them? Oh, fuck. What do you guys think it is? Is it the wrench that was used to take him out? Is it... It's not the missing license plate themselves. Because that's what we're talking about. So why? how could the missing... We don't have them. How could that be the proof? Um, there's a flag missing. But again, that doesn't prove that he took the license plates. It's got to be the wrench. Scratching around in that book won't Fuck. prove nothing. Fuck me. You should show me some respect. Oh, well. Thank you for your help, Mr. Jacobs. You can speak to Officer Thibault about signing a formal statement. When you get the car out of the way, maybe you could come back and do something about those kids. Well, how about we bring you an umpire's mask? Jacobs dumped the book he was reading in a hurry when we walked up. You curious what he didn't want us to see? Oh. OK, 
Okay, so we have the owner of the vehicle, a degenerate. I'll run John Madsen by R and I. Contact Dewey. details on a William Dewey. This looks like business rather than pleasure. Yeah. That's where the wrench comes in, the Dewey. Uh, definitely not a Mexican. Part of a DOC? Oh gosh, I don't, I, don't, I, I just don't, I mean, maybe, I don't know. I think we've run this place but that's around. okay. Find a game well. It's okay, guys, we missed what? We missed a little detail of him lying about the license plate or something, for that matter. Uh, I don't think it's going to be, a, it's a, I don't think it'll be enough to, like, really screw us. And we're not going for a perfect playthrough anyways. Phelps badge 1247. How could I help, detective? Could you run the name Dewey Brothers? Possibly a dealership or car mechanics workshop. One moment. Dewey Brothers Packard Dealership. Packard Dealership. Got it. Can you put me through to Michigan 2458, please? Connecting you now. Hello, can I help you? LAPD, ma'am. Can I speak to John Madsen, please? He's at school, officer. Uh, what's this about? Is he in trouble? School. How old is your boy, ma'am? Jesus. Wrong person, Mrs. Matson. Sorry to disturb you. Are there any messages for me? There's just one message for you, Detective. A four-door Packard diplomatic license number, Paul Robert 706, was reported missing this morning by Juan Francisco Valdez. Could you have him brought in? He's already here at Central, Detective. He's demanding an audience, as he calls it. Thanks. Can you get a message to Captain Leary? Tell him we'll be in as soon as we can. Thanks, ma'am. All right. I don't know. I am nervous about this one. I'm not correct. Can you cordon off this lot until we have the vehicle impounded? Yes, sir, detective. We'll follow up on the owner. Get a statement from Jacobs, and I'll read your report back at the station. We can visit the Packard dealership or head back to Central and interview this Valdez character. Your call. We'll let, uh, we'll let the Valdez character sweat. <laughs> Even though he's probably, like, he's the one, he's the victim here. We'll let him sweat it out. Let him sweat it. Uh, let's check out the dealership.